All right, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's VMP. Welcome back. This time we're here with a little more Blood for Land. And uh, you guys told me in the comments that, uh, well, so last episode, I thought that we were done with Westfrak. I thought we had completed all the quests that there was to complete. Apparently, I was wrong. There's a few more. Um, so first off, I think we're supposed to come back and talk to this Rodri guy, the uh, Lumberjack. And so we talked to Lord Vankerman and mentioned, like, hey, what you're doing to the Lumberjacks is kind of a dick move. So apparently now we're supposed to talk to him. Oh, shit. Uh, thanks for keeping an eye on Vankerman. Um, it seems he is raising an army in his fortress to conquer all the surrounding lands. The local nobles agree that we must attack. We need a strong commander to lead the siege. Oh, shit. Okay, that seems like a somewhat serious mission. Wow, we're going to do that in a sec. But before we do that, I want to uh, quick outfit our troops. So let's tell you what. Colborn, um, we are going to give you... Uh, the Sword of the Gilded, just because he is on horseback already. Um, tell you what, we'll even give you this better horse, because we lamed that last episode, God damn it, we, just, we finally, we just bought it, and we already lamed it. Um, I think this thing is better than, yeah, this, is, this scimitar is better than what he's got going on right there. Uh, he's good on armor, he does still need an, uh, a helmet and gloves, but we'll, we'll uh, worry about that later. I think what I'm actually going to do is, uh, we're going to quick go back into town to one of those horse merchants and buy another one. Um, just because the Sumter horse is so, so slow. Especially now that we've seen the light and, ha and how nice having a fast horse is. Alright. Tell me you got something good for me, baby. A heavy Sumter horse? God damn it. Ooh, ooh, oh, hello. Sterling horse. Perfect. We'll buy that one. Actually, I think the lamed Sterling horse that we had was still faster than the Sumter horse. Jesus, that's that's so sad. Okay, all right, so we've got that. Um, we've got our new armor that we got at the end of last episode, and that stuff is looking <laughs> real nice. Um, we should be quite tanky for this. Uh, I think I also upgraded our crossbowmen in between episodes. They just had two upgrades that were like a thousand and five hundred, so it was like it was real cheap. So I figured I'd quick pick that up. Um, so we do have some alternatives for range. I'm not sure what the crossbowman cost, um, if it's the same as, like, the composite bowman. I guess we'll just have to see. Alright, let's do it. I will lead the siege against Lord Vankerman's castle. The local nobles of West Frack join you as you prepare the siege camp outside of Lord Vankerman's fortress. I feel like this is going to be one of the tougher missions. I don't know. I'm just getting that vibe. Oh, baby, that is a, a big look. Oh, god damn it, I just dropped our sword of the gilded. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, no. Oh, man. Okay. I actually did that last episode, too. Um, but what I did is I quick uh, just, you know, exited out of Mountain Blade and reloaded the game. Just because I, I wanted to start over. But I wasn't thinking what we can't actually do is just wait until we can respawn um, with... Uh... How strong are the troops coming out right now? Are they very strong? I don't think so. Okay. We're just going to get off the source. Use this thing two-handed. And just collect some wood for right now. Um, but yeah, we can just wait till we get a temple and then respawn. And we should have our Sword of the Gilded back. So it's not that, that big of a deal. Alright, oh, getting crushed by a tree. No big deal. Alright, so let's go get this trade route going. Do we have enough food? No. Enough for barracks. Alright, there we go. Let's get some iron here. This is an iron one, right? Oh. No, it is not. That is, that is just a regular rock that we are smacking with our, our stone heart. And so is that. Okay, where's the... Okay, that one looks like one of the, the harvestable trees. Is there any fighting going on? Oh, yes, there is. Uh, Vankin Militia. Alright, well, hopefully these dudes aren't that tough. I'm not going to be too fussed about that. Colborn's going off. That new Sword of the Gilded we gave him is uh, clearly working. Holy shit, he's doing a great job. I guess he... I mean, realistically, he has good armor. He has an amazing sword. There's no reason for him not to be killing it right now. Alright, so let's start buying some more shit here. Uh, we'll get the blacksmith. Not enough resources. Okay, I gotta remember it's H. I almost want to rebind my uh, drop weapon button instead of G to like just something else. Because <laughs> it's going to happen a lot. <laughs> That's just going to keep on happening in this series, I can guarantee it. I even like looked at it at the beginning of this battle and I was like, which one is it? I think it's G. Nope. Rip. Rip our sword. Soldier of Westfrack. Okay, so we actually do have some troops that are just naturally spawning. They look halfway decent. 
How big is this? Oh, God, this is a huge ass castle, man. All right. Ooh, look at that big tree. I wanna, I wanna chop that one down. Um. All right. H. There we go. <laughs> Got it right this time. I'll get that. How much do we need? Oh, we just need some more gold for that. Um. Can we get a caravan already? Tell you what, let's just start getting caravans right away so we can get a lot of gold income. I'm really, really looking for a beefy economy here. Cause those actually. Hmm. Last episode, it really helped out when we when we got a bunch of gold and we were able to get a whole bunch of our knights of the gilded or gilded knights. Um, I'm not sure. Ooh, ouch! The fuck just shot me? Who just shot me? Um, but I'm not sure how much that's gonna help this episode, just because. Wait, what the fuck? This is Lord Vankerman's castle. Why is he chilling in Westfrack? Like when he's got this thing. That is a pretty nice bachelor pad, I gotta admit. All right, we leveled up. Nice. His troops aren't that strong, though. We're just... We're smacking them around with our pole hammer. That sounds like a sexual innuendo, but it's not. <laughs> it's not at all. Alright. Fuck off. Fuck off. Ooh. Oh, you just barely dodged it. What is... Ugh. Is this... Why does... It, his moat looks like... I mean, I know it's grass down there, but it looks like it's like nasty green water or something. I don't know. Ugh. Ugh. It's like... The grass is too green down there. It looks unnatural, I guess. I don't know. And down you go. All right, so we should have enough. Get this. Oh, no, I still don't have enough. Come on. Come okay, on. Get the blacksmith, I guess. Upgrade that. There we go. All right, so we've got that fully upgraded. Go ahead and get this. Look at the temple as well. Oh, no, that takes more gold. Okay, we'll wait. We'll wait for that for a sec. We're actually doing fine with our pull hammer right now. We don't really need... I mean, obviously, our Sword of the Gilded is OP. It's way better than the pull hammer. But, every now and again, it's fun just to use this for lore's sake. Wielding... Craig wielding his own stone heart to take down his enemies. Boom. Oh, <laughs> my bad, Colborn. Just threw him off the edge. Yeah, these dudes really aren't that tough. There are a decent amount of them spawning, though, so... Who knows? Their reinforcement wave, whenever that comes in, could get pretty nasty. And boop, get out of here. Swing, swing. They're not that tough. I mean, a 61 damage blow one-shotted them. It really can't be that tough. This is going to be a long way to get wherever we need to to uh, break down the, the castle. I'm guessing it's going to be... I'm guessing there's going to be another set of walls we need to get past. All right, we good. Let's get the temple. Do we want the temple now? Or do we want some more... Tell you what, we're actually... Ooh, what is this? Scorpion. 35 wood, 5 f or 15 food, 15 gold. This must be what uh, the one chick gave us. Uh, the Empress. Alright, we're gonna get some uh, caravans, three more caravans to just really get that rolling. We don't need to respawn yet. We'll wait for us to die, then we'll save up gold and respawn back in. No need to be wasteful. No need to be wasteful. I didn't see where the caravans are actually. Okay, he's got some knights now. He's got some knights. We can actually. Do we want to. We don't actually want a horse. Do we? What? Do you, why did his? Oh, he's chasing after our dude in there. Vankin Knight. Eh, they're not that tough. They're not that tough. Oh wow, our caravans are getting a lot of gold for us. Forty-seven, thirty-six per trip. That's, that's pretty decent. That's pretty decent. I mean, one trip essentially pays for the caravan, and from there on, it's just profit. And we've got. We're up to. I don't know how many caravans we've got, but we're up to a decent amount at least. Alright, well, I'll tell you what, we can just hold this door and make sure not to, none are, like, really leaking out. Besides that, that one knight that's already out. Come on. Get back in here. There we go. Ooh, who is this? Ouch. Fuck. Who is that dude? He is kind of nasty looking, to be honest. Alright, so they're starting to rank, ramp it up a little bit. But we haven't even started summoning troops. We haven't bought any troops yet. This is all just us. And our passive army. Our heroes and whatnot. Oop, dodged ya. Boom. Ooh, okay, you take... Oh my god, he has a lot of health. 113 damage didn't kill him. 150 damage didn't kill him. Shoot. Oh my god, who is this dude? Is this... This has to be Lord Vankerman, right? Holy fuck. I just want to kill him. And unfortunately, we... Boom. Vankin champion. Only 244 experience for that? Are you kidding me? That dude had like 500 hit points. Those are some... Oh, we're, we're about to die. <laughs> we're going to get taken out by this dude throwing a rock watch. No. 
We're not that pathetic, I guess. We are about ready for this. Uh, should have spawned back in, though. That's for certain. Oop, down we go to a Vankin recruit. How pathetic. <laughs> How pathetic. Alright, let's get the temple. And we can revive. No, we don't have enough gold. Oh, we basically have enough gold. Nope, still not. Come on. Ugh. Ugh. 133, come on. We're almost there. I need one of these caravans to... There we go. Thank you. Um, I guess we'll also get a stable. Not enough gold. That costs gold. Yeah, we're banking a lot of resources right now. I think we're in a good place. I think we're in a good place. Um, might not be a terrible idea to start stationing some archers up on this hill. I mean, they won't really hit anybody from there. Um, but just keep them safe while we uh, mass them up. I'll have to look in a sec and see what these uh, new scorpion units are. And how much the... Um, the crosswoman cost as well. Oh yeah. Okay. It's nice to have the sword of the gilded back. All right. So what do we got here? So hired crosswomen are just forty gold. Okay, that's interesting. We might actually use the. I don't know how useful ranged units are going to be in this battle. Um. But I want to see what these scorpions are like. So let's get some of them. Scorpion warriors. Where are they at? Where are they at though? Are they these guys? Nope. Soldier Westfrack. Definitely not a nuke. Oh, they're up here. Okay, I vaguely remember these guys now. They're like... Kind of look like just desert assassins or something. What kind of... Oh, they have... Oh, they're ranged. Oh, very nice. Whoa, the velvet is selling for so much. Oh my god, we're making bank off that. Okay, we're just gonna get... What is that? Like, seven more caravans? Ooh, they are starting to get a lot of knights out. Do they have their own villagers? Is that what's going on right now? Because if so, we should probably find them and take them out so that their night production goes down. Because I think that's an actual thing in this mod. I think. I wonder if there's any way for us to upgrade the uh, the scorpions. Just because a ranged unit like that could be pretty big. Especially, like, in a, um... Say, in that, that, that bandit siege that we got crushed on. That could be pretty big, because not only can they soften the enemy up... But they look like they should be pretty decent in melee range as well for when the enemy actually gets there. I'm hoping. Oh, fuck. They got another one of these champions. Fuck off. You're OP as shit. I mean, so are we, but still. We're the only ones that are allowed to be OP. Not you two. At least he doesn't have a shield, so if we had a bunch of range, they'd probably be able to eat him up pretty quick. His, his armor isn't that tough. He just has a ridiculous amount of hit points. His armor is actually almost, like, weaker than the rest of these guys. Ouch. He does do a lot of damage, though. That is a nasty sword he's got. Alright, what do we got here? I think it's time for us to start sending in some troops. What about you? Alright, so we'll put our archers up here for the time being. Um, I mean, the, uh... Yeah, I think we're just gonna get some more of those um, composite bowmen. Where are they at? Oh, here we go. There they are. Yeah, so we'll get a bunch of them. Actually, we can get like 50 of them. Yeah, we should be able to get like 50 of them. That'll be a pretty... Holy shit. <laughs> and nobody's coming in our house. I don't think so. Um, I guess we can get all... Oh, we should be able to get a ton of sword militia as well. And then we'll go ahead and do that. This should be a pretty good first wave for us. I don't think we're going to send the bowmen in right away. Is that enough? Are we done with that yet? I can't tell. Oh, there we go. Ooh, Chadwick level up. Good, good job, Chadwick. Where the... Oh, our caravans have a really long way to travel. Maybe that's why uh, they're giving us so much gold for every trip. Uh, that probably is. That's normally how it works in most games. Okay, we're going to head in, do a little bit of scouting, find out where we need to go. Um, our uh, wave of... Oh, yeah, I can already see our comps at Bowman going to work. Our wave of sword militia should be able to... I mean, it better be able to keep out all these dudes. For the time being. Um, Alright, so I guess let's just follow where these troops are coming from. And hopefully they lead us to where we need to go. Oh yeah, so there is a second wall here. It's an actually a crossbowman. Get back here. Get back here. Alright. Okay, we got a, I actually got some troops just stationed here. 
Interesting. Well, we're just gonna back up on out of here. Oh, crap. They're about to... Okay. Thank God they didn't. <laughs> I was worried they were gonna lame our horse, and I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Ouch. Shit, they are... Ooh, ow, 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 ow! <laughs> Craig doesn't like this. It hurts. It hurts even his stone heart. Okay, there we go. These guys all have shields. It's very annoying. There we go. Ouch. We got a lot of troops here. I'm kind of worried for this reinforcement wave, but I have a feeling it could get pretty nasty. On you go. On you go. Alright, I think we killed... Did the guys that were inside actually follow us out? I think they did, so they should be cleared out now. At least for the most part. Maybe a few more of them will have spawned back. Oh, never mind. Still here. Is there a way around this? Can we get up from there? Ooh, I think we can. Alright. Craig's gonna do some sneaking. Alright, so we're starting to... Sorry, well, while we're not really doing anything, let's get some more caravans. Just because they're making us a lot of gold right now. Making us a lot of gold. So I really... Yeah, we're really gonna have to look on... Okay. No, maybe we can't get around. Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Oh, no, archers. Oh, shit, that's a, that's a lot of crossbowmen, actually. Um, I thought originally this was going to be fun. This could actually get... Eh, they're not... I'll tell you what. No, they're not very strong. This is good to wipe these guys out now. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Uh, we're actually taking a lot of damage. It hurts. It hurts. Can we actually... Tell you what, we'll finish these guys off and then survey where actually Lord Vankerman is and everything. He should be around here somewhere, right? I assume it's is it that main keep door that we have to break down to win this. Where is Lord Vankerman at? Who's shooting at me? Oh, is there another big group of them over here? Get out of here. Taking out all of his sharpshooters. We should probably level up, by the way. Um, what are we? So we're going for intelligence now, right? Right? I think that's what we were doing. What are we at now? Eight? It looked like three when the text was up. Um, Alright, so I guess we'll just invest in farming for right now. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Uh, oh, there's another big group. Lovely. Doop. Doop. Oh, yeah, we're just ripping through them. We're just ripping through them. So, apparently, from what one of you guys told me in the comments, uh, last episode when we got that potion from the Mountain King, I want to say, that increased our Iron Flesh and Athletics by four, it's, from what from what he said, it's not just us, it's also our troops that got plus four Athletics and Iron Flesh. And if that's true, that's actually pretty huge. Um, that helps out a ton. Because for us, I mean, yeah, that's a nice bonus, but we already had Iron Flesh maxed out, and uh, Athletics was already at seven. So we really only got three skill points out of that, personally. But, um, our troops, on the other hand, that's big. Oh, am I an idiot? It's this thing that we have to fight, obviously. <laughs> I'm stupid. <laughs> okay, it's pretty heavy. Um, and this is definitely going to spawn a wave after a while, which might be a bad idea. But, hey, we like to keep things spicy. This this will be fun. This will make things interesting. Ouch. They're actually sending troops after us to stop us. It's not, we can't get away with it like we did in the uh, desert uh, fortress or whatever. God, this thing is, is hard to break down. Okay. Does this thing do more damage? Is it definitely faster than our pole hammer? Yeah, there we go. This is better. That's yeah, a lot faster. Right, we're working it down. It's getting close to that one third. Oh. I wonder if we're going to be able to see the wave that spawns in. We probably actually won't be able to. Oh! JK! There it is! <laughs> hey, sword militia. Y'all have fun with that. Y'all have fun. Oh, shit. Okay, they're coming after me now. They're like, wait a second. We spawn in when there's when we're taking a lot of damage. I don't see any troops here. What's going on? And then they figured it out. Jesus, there's a ton of them. 143? God damn. Boy. I mean, we could actually probably finish this thing off right here. Because they're not actually going at us. Where are our troops at? Are they getting close? Tell you what, we should actually probably charge our archers in. Because they're not doing anything for us right now. What do you want? Away with you, vile beggar. 
Oh, down you go. Yeah, I think we can just take this thing out right here. Jesus, that's so many of them. Okay, let's, uh... Oh, look at all the resources we got, baby. Look at all the resources. Okay, um, let's... I like these scorpion units, if I'm gonna be honest. Fuck off. Um, yeah, let's get a whole bunch of these scorpion dudes. I like them. So we'll get some of them. Um, we'll also get some, uh... Gilded Foot? No, no, okay, nope, never mind. Not Gilded Footman, that's a bad idea. We'll get some more Sword Militia. Might get a few knights as well to go along with it, because we do have an excess of gold. Could always get, I guess the the uh, or the barbarian mercenaries also only cost gold. Same with the Templars, but we haven't upgraded the barbarian mercenaries, I don't think. Um, yeah, so let's get some uh, Gilded Knights in here. Because we do have such a crazy amount of gold right now. So I'll do all of that. Okay, that's good to me. Go ahead and keep on whacking on this thing. How are, are our troops getting close here? Oh, look at the wave. We got, we've got 204 now. Now we outnumber them. All right, so we'll just whack this thing down real quick. There's so many of them, they can't even get out. Oh, yeah, because they've got all the, the, the those, like, uh, 20 or 30 units that are just stuck in there. Or that are guarding it. It's still so funny that there was a hole in the wall over there. Like, they tried to make it look like there wasn't a way in. And I was like, maybe there is. Maybe we can jump over this somehow. And nope, it's an invisible wall. Couple more swings here. I'm going to finish it off with a pull hammer. And a swing. And a swing. Victorious. Nice and easy. Get out of here. Get out of here. Who's this? What the fuck? Can't even hurt him. Okay. Wow, he knocked us unconscious. Okay. Boom! We won! Alright, let's go to our hometown? West Frack? Let's go to West Frack and talk to the, uh... The Lumberjack. In charge. Whoop! I think there's another mission, like, over there, maybe, somewhere. Whoops, okay. Straight into a, straight into a house. Very good job. Okay, um... Lord Vankerman has reduced... Uh, what the f... I just... Okay, I guess we're just not going to talk about what we just did there. <laughs> Makes no sense. Um, let's try talking to Lord Vankerman. I, I imagine he's going to be somewhat pissed off. Just slightly pissed off at what we just did. Actually, this could spark another battle here. That'd be... Oh, no, he's gone. All right. I mean, I guess mission success. We did it. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we'll go back to West Frack then. There's still one more land that we... Oh, wait. Um, hold up. Hold up, wait a minute. Okay, so, in between episodes when I was collecting taxes, we got this mountain cloak. Um, which was from when we taxed the new Mountain King's homeland or whatever it was. The Bear Claw Canyon, I think. Something like that. Um, and I'm, I wonder if this is what that one dude was talking about when he meant by special items. We also have some arrows as well, so let's... No, okay, never mind. Guess it doesn't count. You guys were saying that there was some stuff in there that you could trade with him. Um, I forget what it was. I think we sold off some of it. <laughs> like, we already had a couple of them and we sold them off. So, oh well. Alright, uh, back to our hometown. So, I'll quick do a tournament match to get us some more money. And then... Actually, tell you what, let's uh, check out our boy, Old Smitty Werbin. Does he have anything good for us today? 52 and 25. That's, that's not too shabby. Uh, I don't know if that's better than anything we currently have, though. Chief's Axe. That's actually a lot of damage. 96 weapon reach. 40 cutting. That's not too... That's not terrible. I mean, that's the same amount of damage that our Sword of the Gilded has. Obviously, not the same range and speed. Um, but not bad. Uh, yeah, nothing I'm really... I'm not really seeing anything worthy of our heroes yet. Nothing worth spending our dollar on. Nah. Okay, they'll just wait. So, I'll be back in a sec. Okay, tournament won. Um, and now that I'm actually thinking about it, I think what one of you guys said was it's some of the items you get from hunting is uh, count as unique items that you can give to the trader. Um, yeah, considering how much I hate hunting, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> I don't... Uh, we'd have to... Uh, 
I mean, I'll probably do it eventually if I confirm that that's what it is, but... God, I just absolutely hate hunting. Like, after the first couple times, it got it got old real quick. Alright, so let's go ahead and gather some uh, taxes. We're just going to go Stallion Pass. And then uh, we're going to... I think we actually... We still have... Yep, we still have to do the Frozen Tundra here. So, let's go ahead and do that. The final one from the Magistrate. And then, we obviously, we have a few more lands left uh, over there by the that we actually have to travel by boat to. Um, how we travel by boat to there, I don't know, since our two boats over there are uh, sitting on a lake. But, you know, hey, whatever. Maybe maybe they're just w right across the way. Alright, the bitter cold of the region uh, makes you second-guess your decision in coming here, but if the locals can thrive here, you can make a great settlement of this tundra as well. The Snow King and his followers are few, but well-trained and powerful. Ooh, interesting. Alright, so H, there we go. <laughs> Not losing my sword of the gilded today. Not today. All right, let's uh, chop down some of these trees. I think. Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, twenty wood. Ooh, ooh, not bad, not bad. All right, so where are, do the caravans go in this one? Are they? Is that a little keep up there that I saw? We'll check that in a sec. Are we just missing? Jesus Christ! Come on, Craig. I know it's cold out here, but that doesn't that doesn't mean you that doesn't give me an excuse to miss an entire tree. All right, um, not not entirely sure. Is this? Oh, that is a little keep that they got there. I might want to take that out quick. All right, yeah, they do have some. Looks like decently well armored dudes over here. Shield bears, huh? Not too tough though. They got. Oh, what the hell? That looks like. Is this another Empress Rita? <laughs> or Riata Cheese? Whatever the fuck her name is. Uh, oh no, that's this. Oh, the Snow King himself actually comes out and fights. Alright, respect. I can respect him for that. Alright, we're gonna quick take out this keep right here. Just so we don't. Ow! Oh, fuck! Just so we don't have archers hitting us. 34 damage. God damn. Now you gotta remember in this mod, um, the health is uh, buffed significantly. So even though it says that we have 85 health, we have at least triple that, I think. I think it's gotta be in the two or three hundreds. Um, just judging by how much damage we can take and survive in like the arena, um, it's a lot. Alright, there we go. Took them out. All those dudes are gone. Perfect. Some error messages. But nothing crashed, so we're doing fine. Alright, uh, I think we have enough here. Let's get this. Let's get this. Uh, start buying what we can over here. Nice. All right. Doom. Ouch. Fuck me. Did he just like hit our horse and us with the same shot? God damn. Oh, hello. Oh no, it's a horse. For some reason, I was thinking that was a cow that we could like kill and get food from, but I don't know why I thought that. It's clearly a horse. Okay, there goes our... Wow, they do a lot of damage. 54 damage to our horse. Alright, good thing it wasn't crippled, man. Ow. This guy's tough. Fuck me. What are... Oh! Ah! Good God! Alright. I, I got your point, man. Yeah, let's kill this crossman just so he doesn't take us out. Fuck. This dude's hurt. I hurt a lot. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to go do some farming. Get some more resources, because we're about to get taken out by these archers. Jesus. Alright, looks like they're not firing at us anymore. Watch as I say that. We get shot in the back. Oh, they're trying to. Definitely trying to there. Alright, put the shield away. No, stop trying to stab the tree. That is not, that is not the optimal way to cut a tree down. Is by poking it. You want to do a little bit of slicing. It's actually, okay, kind of random. Um, for whatever reason, you... Oh... Oh, man, that was right. Good God, that was right through our head. All right, there goes Craig. Down goes Craig. Um, oh, shit, we're not even close to enough gold. Ugh. All right, uh, I guess we're going to have to spawn as somebody else. Can we spawn as a caravan? Oh, my God, we can. What? <laughs> That's hilarious. Um, I don't know what to do. Where do we get food at? Is it over here? I don't know where we go to get food. This is actually a complete waste of food or er, of gold. <laughs> I'm gonna be completely honest. This is over here. Velvet, please. Please. We're the worst caravan person ever. Can we dismount? <laughs> we can. <laughs> where do we I don't even know where they go to Oh, is there something over there? I think it might be a way off in the distance over there. Hmm. 
can, but I see some food over here. How much how much gold do we have? Alright, so we got enough for a temple, so we just gotta wait. We need 130 more, and then we can respawn as Craig. Okay, we'll be fine. <laughs> for right now, we're gonna roam around on this slow as fuck camel. Actually, maybe we should have just rode that uh, sheep back, because apparently if you, if you, like, get an animal like that, you can ride on them and take them back to, like, your camp, and then you get passive income for the rest of the battle. That might actually be worth it. Oh boy, he does not hit hard. Does not hit hard at all. He also can't hit the tree. There we go. Jesus, man. <laughs> of course. Well, I guess. Actually, I was gonna say it's it's good to know this. It's not really good to know this. There's there's no real point to this knowledge. Like that, we would never ever use this for any reason. <laughs> um, I might actually just let them kill us. Just just end my life. Yep. Just just end it all. Oh, there we go. Thank you. We got enough? 109? Not quite. God damn it. Um, do we want to just come in as like a... No, we're not coming in as a clubman. Yeah, we'll just wait a little bit. We'll just chill out. How many enemies are there? 34. Okay, it's starting to pick up a little bit. It's starting to pick up just a tiny bit. 143, we're getting close. We're getting real close. Our gold production is actually not that small. Oh, uh, yeah, they're starting to get a lot of troops out. Coldborn really isn't doing as much damage as he was in the last one. I think this mission is definitely significantly tougher than the uh, previous. Okay, there we go. Let's get the barracks blacksmith. Get some more of that going. Um, got a bunch of wood and iron and whatnot. Just not a lot of gold. For uh, obvious reasons. That's <laughs> uh, kind of our bad. Alright. We'll just quick clean up all these dudes that are going around here. Watch out for those two-handed macemen that just absolutely destroyed us last time. These guys are pretty tough. Um, they do a lot of damage. Like, they're easy... To, they're kind of like glass cannons. They're pretty easy to kill, but man, they took out our horse. Like, it wasn't even a problem. Oh, look at the... Look at the little camel just running around. How cute. How quaint. Alright. Well, let's quick run through these dudes. Do we have enough for... Okay, we can get our first caravan going, at least. Unlike the last battle, this isn't going to be one of the ones that we can cheese and, uh, you know, just run up to their tower and quick snipe it before they can react. We're going to have to actually battle this one. This is actually, that, that'll be a really nice hill to put our archers, that one right there. Once we get a bunch of them rolling. We had like a hundred of them in the last battle and we never really used them. You would think that in a siege you would want range, but it's kind of not how this mod works. Alright, so looks like they got some. Uh... Alright, well, we're just gonna run up here. Yeah, they got a lot of units here, man. Got a lot of units already. Why do all the mountain kings look. or all the, like, lords look the exact fucking same? I'm not being racist here. They just look the same. Oh, wow, we sniped them somehow. Okay. There goes the snow king. Alright. We've got enough. Alright, there. Let's get three more caravans. So we got four of those rolling. Let's uh, we'll start bringing in some sword militia. Why not? Why not? Um, then we'll also get. So let's get the composite upgrade. We'll just upgrade all of them right now. Let's get. Um. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get a bunch of composite bowmen. We get at least what is that? Like twenty-five of them or so. And we'll station them right on this hill. Yeah, maybe a little bit forward on that hill. Just to make sure that they can all see the enemy. There we go. This will be a good spot. Hopefully 40 of our composite bowmen can at least hold off the couple of crosswomen that they got up there. Fingers crossed. They should be able to. They should be able to. And a swing. These guys are smart, man. They even know how to, like, block and stuff. And they're tough. Jesus. Yeah, this is why we need our bowmen. Our bowmen should be able to... Because they don't have shields. Yeah, this will be perfect for our bowmen. They'll just eat them... Eat them for breakfast. Actually, is that the right spot for them? We might actually want to move them, like, over here. Yeah, actually, we're going to move our, our bowmen over here. Just because that hill is almost kind of blocking them. So, we'll put them right here. Alright, good enough. We'll get a, three more... Yeah, three more caravans. And that should be good for the rest of the battle for us. Um... Do we gotta... So, now we'll save up for... Until we can get, like... I don't know, 10... Yeah, about 10 or so... Uh, Gilded Knights. Send them out. And then... We, okay. There goes our horse. 
Oh, man, it's a lot of long-range people right there. Yeah, no, thank you. We could really use a ranged weapon, but I can't afford... Or I can't... I can't part with our pole hammer. I'm not willing to lose that. Give it up. Is that only... Oh, hello. Sterling horse. Lame. Even if you're lame, come back to me. Oh. Ah, there we go. Thank you very much. Oh, man, they are just destroying our sword. Okay, they've got knights, too, now. All right, this battle, not a joke. All right, that's fine. Jesus. This isn't even, like, their main reinforcement wave. This is just a, 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 like, side one. This is, like, one of the timed ones that comes out. Not even, like, the one that comes when you, you do a bunch of damage to their keep. Jesus. Snow Knight 500 experience? What? Boy. Okay, let's uh let's get some more cobs of bowmen. Yeah, that'll do it. Um, still have I was gonna wait until we had 700 gold to get a volley or to get a group of 10 gilded knights, but uh, we might not even be able to wait that long. Well, we've got 420 right now. Blaze it. Um, that's enough for six of them. Hmm. I don't know. I might have to might have to do. We've, we've at least sniped a, a few of these knights out out of the way. There we go. There goes another one. And our... our, our yeah, our composite bowmen are actually doing a pretty good job of uh, wiping these guys out as well. well. That was a snow knight as well. Hell yeah. I mean, those are worth a lot of experience. I can't complain too much. Oh yeah, our composite bowmen are just raining shots down on these guys. Alright, where's... uh? Yeah, they're not even really getting hit all that much. These these dudes, for being called marksmen, they're not that accurate. They can't even hit our troops from all the way over there. I guess maybe they're not even they're not even really aiming at our archers. Bit of a mistake, but all right. How many we've got enough? Okay, now we've got enough for our, our wave. Oh, never mind. Well, okay, yeah, we we do. Oop. All right, give me a sec. All right, let's get a whole bunch. Ouch, uh, that hurt. It's a good thing those guys aren't that accurate because they do a fuckload of damage. Like, if they're doing that much damage to us and our new armor, can you imagine how much they're doing to our troops? They're like one... That's probably why our sword militia went down so fast, is they're getting like one-shotted. Ouch. Actually, wait, I think this is some of our own composite bowmen hitting us right now as well. I don't think they do damage to us, but... <laughs> it's at least hurting our shield. Alright, here we go. Let's uh, get a little of this going. Some more sword militia. Um, get some more gilded knights. Yeah, they're rolling in. Um, and then I guess we'll get some more cobs to bowmen. Get rid of that extra wood that we got. Alright, looks good. Looks, oh, and we're down. And we're down. Jesus, 25 damage. Yeah, those marksmen were going off on us. Okay, so our boys are in. Look at all those arrows flying. Oh, it's perfect. They've got to be doing a lot of damage to the... Oh, yeah, they're doing a lot of damage to the keep right now. Alright, so we've got just a little bit more, a few more velvets coming in, and we'll be able to spawn back in. Oh, crap. The reinforcement wave is about to come in for them, and we're not going to be there to help stop it. Oh, almost 141. Come on. There we go. We're back. Alright. See if we can watch when this reinforcement wave comes in. Watch them just kill all of our gilded knights. Actually, it might be... Might be a smart idea to tell my guild knights to run away when it comes in. Just so that they don't get surrounded and killed. Oh, I don't think that's their reinforcement wave. Did they not do that much damage? I guess they... How are all these arrows not breaking down this castle quicker? What is that? Oh my god, they barely did anything to it. What the hell? What the fuck was this? kidding me? Troops. I single-handedly take down entire castles faster than you're breaking this thing down right now. Pathetic. You disappoint me. Alright, I'm the- Oh, there it is! There it is! Okay, um... Go to knights! Run away! Oh, they're all dead, I think. Oh, no, maybe not. Um... Yeah, there's a decent amount of them left. They're just... None of them have their horses anymore. <laughs> um, 
Oh god, and then they just got one of their big timed reinforcement waves with the knights as well. That's perfect. Okay, luckily our... Our comps at Bowman should be having a field day on these guys. They don't have shields. But they're not, they're not really seeing them doing a whole lot, to be honest. Right, let's see if we can take out this... I want to take out this knight without killing his horse, but unfortunately the angle that he's coming at us is making that very difficult. Alright, that's one of the high damage dudes, so we'll take him out. And you. And you. Oop, hello. Miss me. Miss me. I guess there's another horse over there that we can take. Is he coming back for us? Alright, uh, so we'll quick take this crop element out just so he doesn't. Oop! You missed! Alright, let's send another way then. Got enough for an, almost another 10 Gilded Knights. Something like that. There we go. Took him out. Oh, leveling up with a VMP move. That's how you do it in fashion. In style. Block you. Die. Die. Get out of here. Ouch, that hurt. Just want his horse. Just want his horse. Ouch, that hurt. That hurt. Their crossbowmen are shooting at us. Uh, ignore me. Ignore me, please. God damn, that horse is running away. Uh, okay. Let's hide behind here. Oh, this is a horse or a tree you can chop down. Um, How much? I'm always thinking we need some more. I almost want more caravans, but I mean, at this point, it's kind of too late to be building up our economy even more. So we'll get some more Gilded Knights. And we'll get a whole bunch more sword militia, and then we'll just go with a giant charge of axemen to finish him off. Yeah, we can get a whole bunch of axemen. Oop, hello. You don't see me. You don't see me. Ah, run. Run, Craig. All right. <laughs> just in time. Just in time. Okay. Let's go back in. Actually, I'm going to tell our archers to move a little bit closer now. Let's move up to this hill. So they're looking straight forward at, at all of them. And hopefully they'll be a little more accurate. Look at all these arrows in the goddamn wall. Holy shit. That is intense. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> That's so many. Okay, we're good. We're good. Did they just get another reinforcement wave? I don't think so. I think that was just their basic wave. Are we even doing damage here? On my way, horse. Pulmonary horse? Is that what they called it? Like the... Like, is in the heart pulmonary? Pulmonary vein, that type of thing? That doesn't make any sense. I guess this this mod is Blood for Land. Maybe that's just a very strange reference to the name of the mod. Alright, almost done. Alright, we got some more volleys of arrows coming in. Let's finish it off with a pole hammer. Boom! Haha. <laughs> Ten grand. Too easy. Too easy. Anuk has returned to the battle. Just in time, Anuk. Just in time. There we go. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. Thought that mission was going to be a lot longer at, uh, at the beginning. Alright, so let's see. What is what does old Smitty Werbin got for us? Anything? No, no, not better than what we have. Is that... Oh, I thought for a sec that was another Sword of the Gilded. I was like, our heroes are just going to be stacked. No, he doesn't, he doesn't really have anything nice for us today. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. This has been a pretty good episode. Actually, let's quick check out our new prisoner. Oh, we've got two of them. Lord Vank. Oh, Lord Vankerman. Ah, oh, sweet. Surely, Craig, there has been some misunderstanding. Uh, no. No, you were kind of a dick, man. You're kind of a dick, and I wanted your land. Snow King. All right. What do you want, Craig? Uh, if I release you, what can you do for me? Ooh, I can teach you of our people's iron mining techniques. This could help you greatly in your wars. Uh, yes. Definitely. Iron mining skill plus four. All right, excellent. This agreement will bode well for both of us. I'll add a little gift for being so reasonable. Nice. Maybe we should have asked our dude if that was the smartest route. I guess we can still ask him for right now because he hasn't left yet. I think we can still ask him. He's going to be like, no, you need to threaten him and then he'll give you thousands of gold. You just missed out on so much. Oh, never mind. We can't even ask him about Lord Vankerman, so maybe we, there's no options for him. Oh, whoops, actually, tell you what, we can collect rent, so we're going to go ahead and do that, and then we'll go ahead and end it off. 
So, with this, with the new stuff that we've been getting, maybe, just maybe, we'll be able to uh, win that Fortress Siege. Just maybe. Alright, let's uh, get it from the Frozen Tundra. Dude, finally, some extra money. 2,200 dinars and some throwing axes. Awesome. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed. As always, leave some comments down below. Let me know what you think about the series and all the rest of the series that we got going on right now. And as always, take it easy, guys.